Wait, hold on. That was Immortals of Avium, which is out today. And next up, we're going to step into the world of the Hoyoverse. I am here huh. with Jen Yu Lee, the producer of Zenless Zone Zero. Jen Yu, welcome to Gamescom. It's great to have you here. Thank you, great. yes. Fantastic, it's a great honor to have you here. Uh, we've been very excited to hear more about ZZZ, uh, the next game ZZZ. in the Hoyoverse. Uh, in the Hoyoverse. Can you tell us a little about what you brought to uh, Gamescom for this ARPG? Uh, Wait, I'm, hold on, I'm, I'm pretty sure I've seen uh, footages of um, gameplay of uh, ZZZ before, along with um, Demon Azatop. So there's a there's a new um, Hoyoverse game. Okay. So I know it's been a while since we've given you an update on what we've been working on, and that's why I'm particularly happy to be here today to give you an update on the progress that we've made with this game. Yeah, this uh, as far as I remember, this game has been in, in development for quite some time. So we've brought a trailer with us, um, and it shows you some of the urban environment that we've been working on, and also some of the the um, dynamics of the game. I hope you like it. Excellent. Thank you very much. Here you go. Brand new trailer for Zenless Zone Zero at Gamescom. He feels awkward. He looks like he feels awkward. But anyhow, let's, let's check this, this new um, Hoyoverse game. This is giving me um, Persona vibes. Yeah, this game is giving me Persona vibes. Arcade? Okay. Interesting. A mini game in the game. And now we have combat. Kind of reminds me of Tower of Fantasy, even though it's from a di Tower of Fantasy is from a different um, developer. It give it reminds me of Tower of Fantasy, but it's practically a mixture this of uh, Tower of Fantasy April, and Honkai Persona. Star Rail made its global debut, and the game oh. has captivated players. Did he just say Conquest Star Rail? Grand journey, and today we're excited to share a special look at its beloved characters and provide an update on its PlayStation Five release. PlayStation 5 release. The oh, Fushuan. General of all affairs. Jing Yan and the punching bag. Sorry. Wushen and Qing Quan. What manner of evil transported us here? Great work, General. General One, Demon Zero. What the hell? Please, please. Right, Plan B. You can't always rely on your last. No. And then Bushan using her ultimate. Music is lit, though not gonna lie. It's an emergency master divider. Jin Yuan's not here, and the Cloud Knights haven't trained in days. <laughs> Looks like I'll have to help Jin Yuan get these slackers in order. You have no 
nowhere to run. Okay, what was that? It's not bad. We got still but more I feel like, for you. Genshin Impact is nearing its three I feel like, um, in the game just released its they're holding back with, with that particular trainer. I mean, they could have just shown um, the, the, the downhill muzzle scene or some sort. Oh, now, okay, never mind. Let, this, okay, now we're, we're jumping right into Genshin. At this point, right? Don't be surprised if you see a Hoyoverse game in a Jeff Keighley event. Don't be surprised. This is the um, the Liyue storyline, the Inazuma storyline, the Sumeru Arc storyline, and now we're here in Fontaine. This is no time for distractions. Seriously, you have a great magician standing right here. And then the underwater exploration, which I kid you not, is beautiful. Beautiful, I would say. I'm just disappointed that the special program didn't do a better job at showcasing the underwater feature. Nothing new. Wait, Genshin concert in this October, Lords of the Fallen. 